The U.S. equity averages are continuing their trek higher. The Dow Jones Industrial Average and S&P 500 are higher by half a percentage point, and the Nasdaq Composite Index is up by 0.8 percent. Now, in today's trading session, the S&P 500 has hit a new intraday high, and this does come on the heels of the Dow closing at a new high in the previous session. Now, the FOMC meeting minutes from the latest uh, meeting, which took place in March, were inadvertently released earlier, and the minutes did show that Fed officials were divided in terms of their quantitative easing outlook. Also, out from China, we did get some economic uh, data, and it showed that the nation uh, reported a trade deficit in March, missing forecasts for a surplus. At the same time, the data does reflect a rise in consumption within the nation. Now, given the broad-based uh, gain we're seeing in the equity markets, financials as well as technology shares are higher, Facebook shares have gained by as much as 3% at the New York Open, and this does come as General Motors will be returning to Facebook as an advertiser. And family dollar shares are down by 1.5%. This does come as the discount retailer reported earnings that missed estimates and also issued a weaker than expected uh, outlook. And over in the foreign exchange market, the U.S. dollar has turned higher against the euro with the euro dollar pair trading below the 130.80 level. The U.S. currency also remains elevated against the British pound and the Japanese yen.